It's the video that has been seen and shared countless times by now. A San Francisco art gallery owner spraying this unhoused person with a hose after he says he repeatedly asked for her to move. Now, the district attorney is charging him on that evidence. ABC 7 News reporter J.R. Stone is following the case. Collier Gwynn, the gallery owner who sprayed down this homeless individual earlier this month, was arrested Wednesday after San Francisco District Attorney Brooke Jenkins issued a misdemeanor battery arrest warrant, saying on Twitter, the alleged battery of an unhoused member of our community is completely unacceptable. I thought it was really disturbing. I think it's not okay to like, no matter how bothered you are in any given situation, I think it's not okay to like spray water at someone. Alex Sakiyama lives in the area and is familiar with the person sprayed, often hearing her scream at night. She was often like naked or like, you know, out kind of sleeping here. Yeah, I mean, yeah, she was like, was it that she, bad? She, she would stay around here, yeah. Um, I don't I don't know that it was like bad enough to like attack her. We spoke with Gwen right after the incident who at first did not apologize. I find it hard to apologize when we've had no help on this situation. But then days later did offer remorse for what he had done. I'm deeply apologetic and abhorred when I watch that video. While many have had feelings of outrage watching this video. I was shocked. Um, Definitely disappointed. We have a problem, but that's not the way to solve it. Some, though, told us there are major problems on the streets. While outside of Collier Gwynn's gallery, a man who appeared to be intoxicated set up outside the door. Some in the area say the situation built up to this. It got messy. She was messy. And there was food all over the sidewalk. She made a big mess, and she screamed a lot. And we could hear it, you know, in the building. It was really... It was tough. She needs help. That woman needs help. Collier Gwynn was booked here at the San Francisco jail at 537 Wednesday night. We have reached out to him and his family, but have not heard back. In San Francisco, J.R. Stone, ABC 7 News.